Okay, it's okay. You know, your boy's a professional driver, man. 300K in the road. That's the fourth deer in the last 24 hours, man. I ain't scared. Deer swerver. Good morning, YouTube. It is Saturday, October 6th. We're on 95 in Idaho. It's about 9.30 a.m. Yesterday, we picked up this bike in Missoula, Montana. After dead running from Spokane, Washington, we are picking up a vintage Airstream in Sonoma, California. Airstream going to Thousand Oaks. Bike going to Santa Ana, south of LA. And then on Monday, we are picking up a 22-foot toy hauler slash camper uh, hopefully putting a motorcycle inside of it we'll see what happens thank you for viewing i really do appreciate it please click subscribe so when i stopped that pilot to take a shower i did not realize that I had already made it into oregon Woo! Now we'll be crossing through Nevada into California, picking up the Airstream, delivering the bike, delivering the Airstream, and yeah. Road stop. My body's telling me, yeah, I'm gonna pound on your head if you don't give me food. I have a crazy ass headache because I haven't eaten anything all day, just been drinking a bunch of coffee. Not a good idea, but I do have a very good view right now. It's the desert where the buffalo roam and the sheep cry home because they can't survive up in the sheep. Oh, some wild horses. Yo, horsey horse. Holy shit, we got a tipper flipper, people. We got a tipper flipper. Desert is crazy and I love it. Nico is taking a little lunch break. It is 2.44 p.m. in Nevada. We're headed towards Sonoma from Missoula, Montana with this Kawasaki's KZ900. Picking up an Airstream in Sonoma, dropping off the Airstream in Thousand Oaks, dropping off the motorcycle near Los Angeles, picking up a camper the next day in Los Angeles and taking it to oh, the effing rainbow. No lie. No lie. You see it, people. There's no pot of gold. It's boring as shit at the end of the rainbow. It is just the end of a rainbow, pretty much. It looks like it just goes into the floor. We are in Humboldt County and it looks like there's a storm brewing behind me. The dispensaries are competitive with marketing. They put a billboard literally right over the other store. That's some gangsta shit. When you see emergency call boxes all over a parking lot, I suggest you keep your weapons close to your sides. Yeah. 